Hello, my pretties. How are you guys? Um, I hope that this message finds you well. I'm going to be doing a collective read. This message may, um, this, uh, the signs that may resonate with this is, um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Gemini, Virgo. But it doesn't have to be. So it seems like there's going to be some sort of upheaval. The upheaval is going to make sure that you are on top, okay? You may not see this upheaval coming with the moon, okay? This, this may be unbeknownst to you. I'm not sure if this has already transpired. But I feel like you may have been in an unfavorable situation, I feel like uh, there were people behind the reason why you were in an unfavorable, unfavorable situation. I feel like they manipulated the situation for it to be that way. You may not have seen this coming time-wise, but I feel like you always knew. Because the song that I got was, I told y'all I was going to bump like this. Y'all didn't think that I could bump like this. Right? That's why Kelly Rowland, I think it's called Like This. I told y'all. Like, I'm getting like you told somebody. <laughs> they didn't want to believe it or they thought they was above the law, spiritual law, whatever kind of law, you know, physical law. They thought karma was going to skip them or they thought they was going to get away with something. Okay? But that's not what it's, what, what it's turning out to be. Now I feel like with this Wheel of Fortune here, now that I feel like... That you on the top of this or will be on the top of this wheel of fortune, yeah. You see the seven of swords and the eight of wands. This was this was um, some wicked energy that was being um, projected onto you. Okay, this could be having to do with spell work. Like I said, there's a lot of manipulation here, um, but there's something about yeah. This is people from your past, but there's something about and I'm getting a group. There's something here about objects in the mirror being larger than what they appear. I don't know. Somebody wanted you to be scared of them or something. This was supposed to put fear in your heart as well, especially there's a huge aspect of them not being able to get caught or them flying under the radar or some shit like that. They're giving me um, when Scooby-Doo and them um, used to rip the mask off. And it will always be the same person. Is it red somebody? And I would have got away with it. If it wasn't for you. Meddling kids. Or I don't know. I don't know what he said. Show me. But yeah. The chariot. Show me. And the fool. Something here is going gonna, is gonna to happen. To where you are let go and released from some sort of situation. Yeah, here go the tower again. Doubles. It's two moons, two towers out here. I'm getting both teams. Both both teams. I heard lucky seven. Something about maybe seven years, seven weeks or whatever in seven days. Um, there's, there's, a, there's a tower moment here. And it's going to expose somebody. Whoever this person is, they they being categorized as a knight of wands. Show me about this knight of wands, please. You're going to end up, though, in the ten of cups. Oh, and justice is at the bottom of the deck. Oh, and then judgment. Okay? Ten of cups, justice, and judgment. There's a nice white man here. I don't want to get into him yet, but, um, I don't want to get into him yet. What's the tower, please? 
going to be pulled out of a situation and the way this is going to transpire is going to shock you and it's going to shock the opposing team oh okay i was asking what the knight of wands was y'all excuse me because i'm in pain my stomach hurt but show must go on i go through this shit every month there ain't nothing <laughs> show me Knight of Wands. This is a Sagittarius with the Temperance clarifying the Knight of Wands for some of y'all. This person is finding it hard to keep up whatever game they got going concerning you. To keep up whatever manipulation. It's like it's it's like they feel they feel the tide turning. They feel you know, the table's turning. It's like, oh, oh, oh. And I get, especially, you know, because I remember the reads. I remember the reads that I do. I get that this was a cakewalk to them at first. You didn't know. You was unaware or whatever. They was getting away. They thought so. You might have thought so. I don't know if you thought so. Because I keep hearing, I told y'all I was going to bump like this. Y'all didn't think that I could. Y'all didn't think so. Whoever these people are, they learning their lesson. They didn't think so. They didn't think this shit would get turned on on they, on his head like it did. And now, whoever this is, scrambling. You know, trying to keep this manipulation, lies, or thievery, whatever this is, afloat. Yeah, this and, and keep whatever collaborations afloat. Like, I'm getting like this times where you didn't even see the threats. You didn't see them. You didn't know who they were. They was wearing masks. The Ten of Cups is out here again. Three doubles. Somebody could be 30. I'm getting like there's going to be an expose in reference to who's who and what's what. Because they was working with people. Two of Cups and the Lovers. Let me see what this is. Somebody, somebody's sexuality, somebody's bisexual. In this situation. could be somebody that you was dealing with romantically somebody that you may have had a family with or something the sun is now 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 the sun is is out here twice this person who well, somebody's gonna become exposed this could be a person that had you in some sort of third party situation or had um partnerships that you didn't know nothing about here go the king of wands down here remember they was that was the knight of wands so this is the person that we're talking about like they had a bunch of collaborations you know what i'm saying that you didn't know about that was detrimental to you they're in sorrow right now so my name is brian i was hearing you was there guess we never could agree while the sun Shines on you. I need some love to rain on me. I'm getting this person did not practice reciprocity with you. Still I sit all alone. It's over for these people. This person specifically. Wishing all my feelings was gone. I gotta get over. It's nothing for me to do But have one last time One last time Before I leave it all behind so Yeah, look, hidden truth, something unknown So this is the energy that they was operating under when they came to you Like trying to keep them, somebody gang, they were gang talking I ain't gonna put you off uh, Somebody is hiding a whole... Um, 
Like this is like, this can have to do with destiny. This is Ten of Pentacles energy. This can have to do with destiny. This can have to do with them keeping you from your destiny, trying to switch your destiny out, um, stealing the inheritance. What is this? Ten of, what is this? And this is your family that may have been involved with this, with this ex of yours or whoever this person is. It could be your family, their family, a family. It's a group of people here. Yeah, I'm also getting ancestral energy looking out for you. And they bringing this shit to the surface and, and helping you. What the hell did I say? Ancestors. They ain't playing about you. They bringing justice. Somebody is Rastafarian or have or have uh Rastafarian ancestors. Mm. There's something here about your your strength being highlighted, okay? Yeah. Like you you let me tell you what this feels like. This feels like somebody catching another person in a trap, okay? You know, uh spiritually torturing them or you know, running circles around them, stealing from them, violating them, this, that, and the third. They think that this person is weak or lacking some sort of knowledge that will help them to get out of whatever this attachment energy is. This could even be a spirit that was put on a person to, 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 to keep them um, docile, held down, or whatever. If, you're, if, 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 if this is you, you know, you may have experienced procrastination. Somebody got a problem with their bladder. Um, I don't know. They could have been targeting your womb or whatever. Because we get that a lot, right? And then all of a sudden, there's, there's a, there's a, there's a, um, we traded places, gonna get, get, get. Somebody may be from Atlanta. All of a sudden, you know, there's a individual who winds up coming out on top, okay? That person that was uh, stuck in whatever situation, whatever trap. It's like the situation flips and then now the opposition is stuck in some sort of trap um, because whatever, whoever they tried to trap just, or just, just breaks free. There's something here about strength. There's also something here about, you know, them purposely attaching something there. If you are very intuitive or whatever, they could have attached something with the King of Swords and the Two of Pentacles to your crown chakra. Yeah, it was to stop you from moving forward with the two of wands. It, that's, that's, that's what the point of it was, okay? And I feel like it was working for a little while. Or they thought it was. It's something here about tricking them, tricking your enemies and your ancestors uh, being, being, um, being a part of that. So I seen some shit the other day and, um, and, um, And I was amused because um, I I operate under that energy a lot of the times. But, like, they were saying, I forgot exactly what it was. Oh, but it, it was like, when your enemy throws something at you and you respond automatically, they get to see where your hands is at. You know what I'm saying? They get to see. And, and even when you physically fighting somebody. And you let them get their shit off. You know what I'm saying? Like, boom, 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 boom. It's like, oh, that's how, that's how you fight. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I know what to do with you. You did not show your hand or your hand was not automatically shown in this situation. They had you all the way fucked up. They did. They did, and your ancestors made sure of that. It's given 
the 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 trapper okay gets trapped or the the victim or the predator turns into prey the predator turns into prey your predator now turns turns into your prey Somebody who they, you know, you could be somebody who speak for a living or who's intelligent. You know what I'm saying? You do something that gotta do with communication or whatever the case is. They wanted your head. They wanted your head. They wanted you to shut up. Too. They wanted you to shut up. Y'all. The hermit they wanted to chop and screw your judgment your studies how you saw things and stuff like that um they wanted you to constantly i feel like be tired but there's something here about you healing from this okay there's also you know a thing where they wanted to delay your healing so the tower the tower is basically uh, you know, you breaking free from this. That's like, you know, when you see a movie and like, it's down to the wire. Maybe they in the, um, they giving me Rocky. Rocky. It's like down to, it's like down, you know, to the wire and, and, and they count in one, two, and you down three, four. You know what I'm saying? And they get up to how much they count to 10? I don't know. I don't watch boxing. I would imagine they count to 10. And you get up and something otherworldly is powering you. And you get up and you start whooping ass. Now everybody done bet on that. Everybody that done bet against you is going to go broke. Because they thought they had this shit in the bag. Now your foot on their necks. Tell me the power. <sighs> whatever they did, they they operation is 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 fumbled. Like whatever this was, the operation is fumbled. They was working on it. They worked hard on it. It was several people involved. A lot of people involved. People being paid off and some more shit. It's over. It could have been to stop some sort of relationship from happening um, concerning you. Yeah. Stop the development of your creative energy that will push you into this star energy. Help you to be seen, noticed, recognized, revered. <laughs> they mad. That's what they tried. They, they trying to damn this. Somebody that do spell work is, is like, they, they back at the drawing board. Yeah, I see them doing spell work and then going. <laughs> something about they watching you on social media or some shit like that. Like, um, yeah, or, or, or they could just be watching you in whatever way, especially with this uh, Queen of Cups energy. I heard predictive guidance. So they could be doing um, readers or whatever. And then, like, as soon as they see something, they start to, you know, uh, something about whoever doing readers on you, what they see is not matching up with what they're getting in the cards, okay? This could be a person that eat ice, that chew ice. <laughs> um, somebody here may be anemic or need more iron yeah but whoever this is they readings ain't coming up right it's not matching with what they see or when they do the work there's something here they thought they had a system and I feel like doing readings Seeing what you got going on, doing spell work on it, then watching you to see if it worked. That's that's their normal routine or whatever. Something is going wrong with the routine. The routine ain't routine no more. Something ain't right with the cards or some shit. Or their intuition. Because they, 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 you know, 
especially because this looks like kind of like a backfire, but um, a slow burn type of backfire too. Because they tried to confuse you and stuff. We saw that, but like, hmm, now makes me wonder, you know, if they're not being affected by their own bullshit. I mean, that's, I don't gotta wonder. That's what it seemed like. Let me just call it. Number seven is just keep sticking out. Look, actual money. Actual money. So they jealous. You could have been um set to get some money. Be this could even be like people from your community or even your family. Y'all know family be the fucking worst. Okay? For me anyway. And um then you you ascend in some sort of way and they don't like it. This is crabs in a barrel type of mentality. And this is being led by somebody who you used to sit on. It's what it feel like. Yeah, look, animosity. What's your problem, lady? Karmic, oh, there, there's the answer. She's a karmic feminine. They always mad about something. Always mad about something. Like a karmic feminine. Even, even, the, even men, karmic men, they be suffering from karmic feminine spirits. And it's just, it's giving Jezebel energy. I mean, it's just constant, constant jealousy. Why are you watching my coins? Why are you watching what I got going on? Hands on your hips. You very upset running your pressure up. Pay attention to yourself. Somebody's mad at what you do. They feel like it's going to bring you a lot of money. That's why they try to confuse you from it. For, uh, look. You won. Told y'all I was gonna go like this. Y'all, somebody could be studying to be a nurse or a doctor. Look, with the opposition and change, see, and, and I, that's what I was thinking earlier, trading places. Now I'm hearing change clothes and go. And girl, I promise you, it's no substitute. Uh-oh. Sexy, sexy. Yeah, somebody is mad that you're protected, okay? You're going to reach some sort of achievement. Whatever this is, it, it, it lands you in a space where you don't got to work a nine to five no more or you don't have to do hard labor or something no more. Ain't no worries about no breaking no nails. <laughs> Period, okay? Somebody feel like you got it easy. That's how they feel. They don't want you to. They don't want things to be easy for you. Yeah. See, we have the energy of bondage. I told you. Somebody could have did some sort of spell on you. Somebody, see, with this bondage, emotional pain, and expectation, like... They want you to expect expect abundance, but they was trying to confuse you from expecting something. Like they, they these people was thinking like, oh, if we could get this person to think negative, be confused, feel like they stuck, and all that other shit, and and, and then they would screw up their own future, okay, by thinking that they didn't have one. They was thinking by way of law of attraction, and I told y'all before, okay, um, that um, somebody sexy. But anyway, um, that when people have to use you against you in their in their in the war against you, then that means that if you are their greatest weapon, okay, that means you already won. They don't have they don't have no tools of their own. They using you against you. And at the same time, they underest underestimated you. They did. They underestimated you. Look, this is what they're trying to keep you from. Distant future, sweetheart, and relationship. A twin flame journey. What the fuck? You always mad. And under here is rich girl. If I was a rich girl. Na, 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 na. See, I have all the money in the world. If I was a wealthy girl. Somebody wants you somewhere picking picking apples. Apple picking. 
for 10 cents a minute or some stupid shit like that. Like, girl, all up, come on. I've been picking up this, this, this person that got yellow eyes all the time. Jaundice or what have you. I don't know what's going on with this person. They could be an alcoholic, something going on with their liver or some shit like that. I don't know. They got bigger fish to fry than be worried about you. They do. Show me. person is stressed i told you this is that energy and with the disruption at the bottom of the deck this is the energy of um what we got earlier with that two of pentacles eight of swords energy like oh my god how i'm gonna get the time is ticking the tide is turning and the time is ticking the readings ain't reading no more the spell work ain't spell working no more the lies ain't, ain't lying like they used to no more. The manipulation ain't manipulating like it used to. Show me. So now they feeling pessimistic. Okay, here go that... Um, Knight of Wands energy again. A lot of doubles out here, but I'm also using three different tarot decks, so that's to be expected. But, um, yeah, whoever this person that was once passionate and energetic about the fuckery that they was doing to you is pessimistic. They lost hope, okay? They know you won. That's it. In a game that you didn't even ask to be put in. All right, let me let me pull one from the shaman's oracle. Please ignore the door. I don't know how his throat don't hurt. He do this shit all day, every day, and they need to bring him inside. Mm. The per so we have perfect storm the courage to step into life you see the energy of perfect storm i'm gonna read it but just uh you know with my intuition i'm gonna tell you this is what this is with that moon card energy that we started off the reading with it's like this is a tower that's gonna put you in where you need to be with this energy of perfect storm okay good for you it's not gonna be good for them though that's the thing hold on let me get the book Have you ever had something happen to you that you thought was the worst thing in the world, um, but it turned out something good for you, to be something good for you or whatever? Put a, um, a brief synopsis for me in the comments. Don't tell all your business. Don't make it long, but just brief it for me so other people can read it and they can have hope and stuff like that, okay? When the perfect storm appears, it cautions you to be ready for an exciting if turbulent time the winds are picking up and you need to make sure that you are close to the eye of the storm or you will be buffeted by gusts that may take you far from where you need to be the key is to remain centered and balanced and bear witness as the forces build in intensity notice how the loose stuff is starting to fly around and recognize how little of it you truly need let go of those thoughts, beliefs, and attitudes that clutter your heart and cloud your mind. Then the storm will be absolutely perfect for you. If you wonder what you might lose during a perfect storm, know that it is those things we are most attached to that are taken first. 
as if life were trying to unburden us of our righteous self-importance. Let it all go with the wind. The less you resist the change brought by the perfect storm, the happier you will be. Ride the winds to your next destination. Embrace the rain or snow. Remember that every time you try to argue with nature, you lose. The perfect storm can also be a call for you to seize the moment. There might be a great opportunity that you need to take advantage of right now. Carpe diem. Here, time is of the essence. It may be going shortly, so do not hesitate. Go ahead, bite off more than you can chew, and take the storm on in all its terrifying greatness, experiencing the fullness of life. You will succeed. The tower, there's something here, and I keep getting energy of like polar opposites. The tower is happening for you, and the, and the tower and the moon for you, and the tower and the moon for your ops. If you guys were were all living on the same block and there was a storm, you would be affected by the storm differently, okay? They should be all tore up or whatever the case is. They got to be displaced and they ain't got nowhere else to go. Yours, your, the store may have tore up your front yard where you needed to get the weeds out anyway or you needed to replant. You know what I'm saying? You needed to get that together in the first place, but you had to dig it up. The storm did it for you. Something like that. You understand what I'm saying? This is, this is going to be like upheaval, but only one person is going to benefit from the upheaval, okay? Okay. I hope that helps.